Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how you can quickly and easily view your Smart Hub Amcrest wireless cameras on your desktop. To get started, we're going to have to first download the Amcrest Surveillance Pro application for your computer. You can get that on the Amcrest website, and I will have a link for it below in the description. Once you're on the website, you're going to go ahead and look for this link right here. Go ahead and click on it. It should launch a new tab where you can download the application. The next thing we're going to need to do is download the IP config software. You can get that on the MCRES site as well, and I will have a link for it in the description. Once you're on the site, you can see that there is a Windows and a Mac compatibility. Go ahead and click on the one that works for you best and download and install the software. Go ahead and open the config tool. It should auto-populate the different items. If you don't see any, go ahead and click refresh and they should appear. You're going to notice that multiple items appear. Copy the IP address with the item that has a subnet mask. Usually it's 255, 255, 255, zero. Once you have the IP address of the cameras, go ahead and click devices from the Amcrest Surveillance Pro application. From here, click add at the top. Give your device a name. Let's say this is John's house. Go ahead and type in the IP address here. Next, type in the username and password, and then click add. And as you can see, John's house is now available, online status. So next, we're gonna go ahead and click the plus sign at the top, click live view, and then you'll notice John's house has two different cameras. Just go ahead and drag that in here. Now, as you can see here, I ran into an issue. It says search stream timeout. This is because my cameras are set up with motion detection, so there is no live feed. If you would like to view it live, you go ahead and open up your Smart Hub app and open up one of the cameras. This way you can view the live feed on your desktop. So let's go ahead and move it over. And there you go. If you would like to do this without having to open your Smart App, you will have to turn off the motion detections. Amcrest does this to conserve battery life as constantly viewing the camera would significantly drain the battery. However, I think that should be our choice, not Amcrest. For example, I'm planning on connecting solar panels to my cameras to constantly charge them as I have a lot of sunshine in my area. Also, if you would like to watch multiple cameras, make sure on your mobile app you select multi-view. Uh, you can access it on any of the cameras that you have, just tap on your camera and then you'll see a multi-view option. Select that and then select the other cameras you would like and this way you will be able to view them all at once. And that's all there is to it. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And if you found this video useful, please hit that like button and subscribe as it does help the channel. Have a great day.